Okay, this is there are steps and you kind of not really like stretching at every single angle, you know? Yeah. You're missing some angles. You're, you're walking into a lot of angles. Yeah, you're missing a couple of angles. Hi, I'm Xbox Lasagna gamer who's trying to figure out how to get good at Counter-Strike. I've tried all sorts of things in my quest to get better, and now I'm trying coach. In this video, my coach Pianix is going to look over a demo where I defaulted toward apartments on Inferno. He then goes into a practice server and gives me an enormous amount of useful information and util. This video is part of an ongoing series, so please subscribe for more coaching content. Enjoy the video. Uh, okay, so you're running out with knife here. Mm. Probably not the best idea, because the, here's the timing where the enemies can be already picking you from mid, right? Uh -huh. <laughs> so, so taking a knife here is just not the best idea. Yeah. He could be picking you from long, he could be picking you from short. I mean, if he actually goes around the side and picks you from short, he doesn't have the timing to peek. But if he jumps like before, the right. short, from long, he has the timing to peek you here. And he actually peeks and you're not ready for that. But he just hides. I mean, here actually, on Inferno, it's pretty important that you understand how the map works. Because of the map being so, like, tight and the corridors being so small and easy to block off with utility, mm -hmm. you should actually force second round. Oh, really? Even if we and, don't get plant? Yeah, yeah. Because you have 1,900 after the last round if you yeah. don't get a plant, right? Yeah. So 1,900 plus 2,400, it's uh, 4,300. So that's not really great to buy full AKs, Kevlar's and the utility. You maybe have like a smoke each. That's not gonna be enough to take map control. Oh, that's why people first second round in like pro. Okay. I mean, here you're just running and you're not ready, but the guy trades you, so it's completely fine. Okay, you're doing the molly. That's good. Stuck on the door. <laughs> yeah, that's not good. I mean, you need to have idea that if you're stepping here, if the guy is like pushing up slowly, he will hear you here if you're up, up close, basically. So, oh, put out okay. those steps. Yeah. Oh, this is nice. Grenada! Yeah, again, like, sometimes... Oh. I get owned. Wow. <laughs> Wait. Let me... <laughs> Let me see, what's the issue here? I mean, this position is not bad, actually. I think you just... It's just your shooting. It's just, just where I'm, like, just the reaction is bad. Yeah, this is fine. And you know that you don't need to break that window uh, for the Molotov second, from second mid to apps. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I thought I didn't, like, if you don't break the window, it doesn't go as deep or something. I've been... Yeah, been it doesn't go as deep. It doesn't go as deep. That's true. But it doesn't matter how deep it goes. Hmm. Wow, bro. Good job. <laughs> Not bad, right? <laughs> Not bad. Okay, this is there are steps, and you kind of not really like stretching at every single angle, you know? Yeah. You're missing some angles. You're, you're walking into a lot of angles. Yeah, you're, you're missing a couple of, of the angles. Run for it because it's already burning. <laughs> okay, that, that's fine. I think you're missing that smoke slightly, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> this guy, this guy on site. I think he gets two. I think you just need to focus on clearing the site. Yeah, I think at the time, I mean, obviously you're correct. At the time, I was like, we've killed three toward A. Yeah, <laughs> Surely there always... won't be a fourth, but I think the third was the rotator. Yeah, but to be honest, like, what else do you clear? Like, what else, what else are you supposed to do in that moment? Yeah, well, I mean, you, can see, me, you can see me just looking around like a, yeah. a silly guy. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, balcony. But, like, <laughs> yeah. You know, uh, you might as well clear it, you know? Yeah, like, yeah. Point well taken. If they're actually pushing second mid, if they decide to jump across mid and push second mid and get flashed by their teammates, this is around the time where they're gonna be meeting you. So just gonna run, they're gonna run past your molly, you're gonna be full blind with your knife out, and they're gonna be killing you. It seems like you're completely unaware of that because maybe that didn't happen to you before. 
So I could be throwing it earlier is what you're saying? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah. So you have, gotcha. you have your weapon out or basically. I mean, again, you're like pushing the side, but you're skipping a lot of angles. Like, yeah, you're just running into the side too quickly, you know? Mm -hmm. you, you don't need to stress here. They have shitty weapons. Yeah. You know that one of they. You saw in apps that they have shitty weapons. Yeah. So you can just take your time. You're running in and skipping a lot of angles. You're always making noise running. And uh, that could be like very bad when people are close and they hear you like here. Uh -huh. Uh By the way, do you clear this angle first like this? Because here, if there is an upper like on the on the pixel angle, like you're dead here, you know? Mm -hmm. Okay. I don't really like to clear that. You can clear that angle if you want, but I personally wouldn't. I would like go inside the door and clear this like that. Boom. And go past this angle. I go see. Test. I see. Okay. Cool. Oh, like this. Just like that. I mean, I guess the opera can still kill me, but I'll be like more ready to, to shoot him. But in that pixel gap, you're literally fi fighting pixel versus pixel with a guy who's might be opening. And here, why don't you just like peek the angle slowly? Why are you using this flash, by the way? I think that in general, I have a lot of uh, uncertainty and fear of coming out from the boiler door. Yeah, but what are you uncertain about? Or what are you scared of? The crossfire. Because you just, you just used two flashes for no reason. Yeah. You didn't even peek behind them. Oh, I messed wow. this up. Uh, <laughs> And generally, this is not the best flash because your flash pops here, right? Like uh huh. This. Yeah. What if the guy is posted like this? What if he jumped across mid and he's posted like this? He's not getting blinded. Right. I just need to improve that flash. Okay. Okay. Now you're ready for him. Do you need to watch out? Um, what can I say? You're just missing your bullets, honestly. Yeah. And they're doing these useless flashes. Most of these, like, duels, mm. you're just losing because you're not hitting your shots when your enemy pops up on your screen. Yeah. Like, you're not in the bad positions. Like, not completely bad, at least. And here you're making steps again. I'm just gonna tell you, like, this guy, like, he literally hears everything yes. you're doing. So, yeah, of course he's gonna expect you. I don't know why he's, like, doing AD, AD all the time. Hey, it's me! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and now he's taking out utility. Uh, uh, wow. Oh my god. I, I don't... First of all, like pistol round, yeah. Uh, I'll give you like a good call instead of the, what you were doing because you guys kind of looked disjointed and you, like you didn't know where exactly you want to go. Mm -hmm. Like you kind of got stuck here, right? Yes. Remember? A good call, for example, is you can go as five people from spawn and uh, you just call. Let's go five rush second mid, three first go long, two last go short, and two. Three first people, like you all run second mid here, mm -hmm. and the plan is like this: you you jump across these angles, of course, because these are like the most in, the most obvious angles. So you just jump around the first right. one, and three first people go like long, so they're gonna wrap around the A side, and okay. two last people go like short. Okay, oh, cool. so two last go, go short, and you are extra aware of boilers, so you should be like short until these guys get contact, and then you're like peeking all the angles. I you know? see. No? Okay. And you start running. So this is like the main part of the attack. And these two people are just chilling, like holding boiler and holding short. And then like starting to run when they know where the enemies are. Cool. Because you don't want a situation where you guys are dying on short and the people are like here yet. Like uh, only here, you know. Mm -hmm. And then that's a simple call you can do. Nice. W works a lot of times. Uh, second thing you need to improve is this flash mid. Uh, I saw it actually from Brocky a long time ago. Uh, you just I'm here below the... <clears throat> build this uh, wall and just jump through. Oh, wow, okay. So it pops like literally in the middle of, That's awesome. of the cool. mid. So it doesn't allow the guy to pick from any position, right? Because if you think about it, if the guy jumps across like this, takes his op and picks you here, right? If you throw a flash here on the wall, like it will sometimes not blind them, right? Yes. You don't bounce the flash. But this flash, it pops here. That's great. It pops like that, so whatever, wherever you hold like that, or like that, it's gonna literally blind the upper. I'll just refer this so you can see how blind it is. 
Very. Very bland. Very bland. The next thing, you were skipping this angle because people, you know, sometimes in pikes, they'll run up here and they will get here and yes. hold it like this. Yes, okay. Uh, but when you're running second mid, you were kind of like... Yeah, I don't think I did that once. Like this and... Yep. So, so the thing is, like, you kind of want to look towards Banj because you, if you think about it, you don't have anywhere else to look when you're running here. Yes. Like, you, you shouldn't look like this in the wall or like this because nobody's like, nobody's like running out and doing this. Right. Yeah. Like in in the early round, right? So you might as well check the bench just as a as a safety net. Okay. If your teammates are are mid here and they're not giving great information, you know. Now let's talk about the most important things. So how to play this second mid area. Uh, so what you should be doing is you should be throwing the small E slightly earlier. So throwing it around here. And as you can see, <laughs> it, it can pop like deep even. I can't believe I don't have to break the window. <laughs> yeah, you don't, have to, yeah. <laughs> you don't have to. My recommendation would be throwing the molly. And then throwing a flash of this half hole. Peaking mid. Like this, then jumping up. And then from here, not making any more sounds. Gotcha. You want to clear this, just like on Wiper, clear here, clear here. Then walk up, clear this angle, this angle, this angle, like C. And mm -hmm. you, you can clear those angles <clears throat> just by swinging. Or you can obviously ask for a flash. Like if you ever ask them for this kind of flash to go out boiler, this is like an amazing flash. So you aim kind of on top of this, on the so the drain pipe, and the flash pops right above boiler. That's great. See? Wow. So if anyone's holding boiler, or it's very common to play here with an op like this. Sure, yeah. And Or just hold boiler with an op, and he will just get fully blinded, right? So any angles that hold boiler will get blinded. Um, obviously, under porch won't get blinded. Some angles on mid that hold boiler will get blinded as well. So these kind of angles on mm -hmm. mid, they will get blinded by this. So it's a great flash to, to peek short like this on this flash. And you, obviously you don't need to make steps still, still on this flash. Uh, so you can peek short. Mm. I mean, you can as well smoke long by yourself, basically using your smoke of this, of this wall for long. Then you can bounce a flash, you can jiggle on the flash and then peek on the flash. So the way you want to use this bouncing flash is you want to jiggle on it. The reason you want to jiggle is because if you just use it, okay, and then peek after it, that doesn't work. Do you know why? Look. Because they can dodge it? Look. Yes. But if you throw it and you jiggle on it, you will first of all spot them and second of all you will make them think that you're running out so they might start shooting on the jiggle and now they're either shooting or they're like turning and you're kind of in a good position because you make them think that you're running out so they need to look towards you and look at blinded you know mm, okay fancy i like it you can do something from apps here so whenever you're coming apps here first of all i would recommend clearing angles without like i wouldn't recommend pulling the smoke before clearing angles gotcha so you want to okay. clear this clear maybe graveyard clear close and that's it and now you can pull out the smoke so to never miss this lineup again just throw it from crouch get towards the back of this and look towards the middle of the rag okay so middle of the rag crouched i mean and then stand up and look bottom right of this okay very nice okay cool and then you get you also need to clear out angles so you clear out top bulk because the guy can stand like this mm -hmm. But without steps still. And you, then you can go in the smoke and like crouch stand up on the smoke and have a one way. With this one, you can also add a couple of things to it. So you can... Press smoke. Pick the angles again. And now you can molly uh, pit. Like if you look at the roof, just left of the roof. And you molly pit oh, like that's this. A good, that's a good way to orient it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or, you can go in here and molly under your headshot. Oh, I like that. Yeah, so this is when your teammates are coming long, because this is an annoying angle. Yes. Especially on like Headshot low angle. bites when someone has a deagle and just kills all of your teammates like this, you know? <laughs> yeah. So, 
So that's what you can do. Um, so this smoke, you can follow it up with a flash instantly, by the way. I like to do that as well. And you clear the angles. Let's say you're just walking out. Clearing pit, clearing this. That was a flash in the same exact spot. Yeah, in the okay, same cool. exact spot. You can do something with this. Just a re-smoke here that you didn't ever use. Crouch after you plant in here. Mm -hmm. Or if you're ever on site, you crouch and aim slightly below this corner of the box. Oh, okay. That's very useful. And you can, you, you can smoke like long. Okay, going this side. I would actually not recommend go towards going towards the door like ever. Oh, okay. Honestly. Interesting. Because you're just opening the door and you're making the sound for them. So you just want to go like this. And just walk up here and clear the angles, you know? Mm -hmm. And if you don't want to clear the angles and you want to chill, just I would recommend this spot. And yes. aiming like this. Because if a guy like... Peeks you, if you think about it... This is where his head is going to be. If you're clearing here, you definitely need to stop skipping angles because... You want to clear this, then you want to clear this, then you want to clear this, then you want to crouch up, stand up, clear this. And you want to clear like the here, and this, then this, then this. And you want to walk up and clear the all the other angles, right? Like right, okay. these ones before you take a smoke. And you are kind of skipping some, some of those angles. Yeah, definitely mm -hmm. need more time in YPRAC for that. If they have eco and your teammate is going in apps, you can do this kind of like spam. Oh, okay. That gets the little cubby. Mm -hmm. No, it gets like middle of the the corridor as well. Oh, cool. If you're if you're doing the spam, you need to make sure someone mollied boiler because if a guy here is you spamming and he doesn't <laughs> have a molly here, boom, you're, you're dead, right? Yeah. You need to make sure of that. Uh, there's also like a cool sequence that you can do with your teammate here in apps. If uh, one of you wants to like rush up apps, like one of you, let's say, wants to do this, just has a mag ten, <laughs> and is kind of doing this play. Like this. Mm -hmm. One of you can come here. Okay. And throw a flash. Yeah, that's like a this. sick flash. That's awesome. Yeah, because you wanted to pop like in the middle of that corridor. So right. Maybe it was in the middle of this gray thing. Yeah, this is way better, there it right? Is. Yeah. More. Yeah. So if they like try to walk up. It's good for the oper as well, like because people like op here sometimes. Mm -hmm. I don't know if they do that in your games. Rarely. But a lot of times in troll, level, people will come here with op. They will post up here with op, and the guy with rifle will hold like this. So this is an anti, anti op flash, or as well this works for rushing abs, because this is gonna be mollied. And the guy is just rushing up, getting flashed, boom, and taking abs control, you know. Okay, do you have any questions about this T site? Like So you show me that mid flash. I guess is there anything else I could be doing towards mid? Yeah. Yeah, of course. I mean you can be smoking long and just taking mid control. So what I like to do is like just go here for a flash, jump into Maxi, hold these angles for a moment, and then like molly short. Check apps. Hmm. Do this kind of smoke towards long. The molly is still burning, so I'm holding a flash, flashing, taking this, and then like clearing these angles. Cool. It's like a whole sequence that you can do. You, you probably need to practice this for a moment, but this kind of smoke from here is pretty good to do. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I All mean, right. you also need to know this smoke to execute A if you're ever coming A. Moto it's smoke. Just moto smoke. Yes, yeah, I, I do don't know, know if that you know one. it, but I haven't seen you throw it. Instead of throwing any useless flashes, you, you can like learn this flash. Do you know oh, this that's flash? nice. No, I don't know that one. This would actually blind this angle that wow, you Wow, okay. <laughs> so so you, if you're running up A, you can just like aim in the middle of window, jump throw, and then look towards bark, and then when the, the flash pops, you're running into the side. So it blinds any like side angles. And it even blinds like this. Everything. It blinds everything. Apart from Pit, maybe. I mean, it blinds Pit as well if he's holding the cross to side. So yeah, this is like a good burn. entry flash that you can do. Cool. Not, not, not much things, I think, about apps and that I have for you. For coming up short, um, is it just mollying Pit, basically? 
is how to deal with that. I know some Wait, people what? like to smoke in front of it, and which lets you cross like the site. Molly uh, is, yeah, is I, good. I like to I like to smoke like this, like here. You look, you just come here and look at this shadow and smoke. And it's kind of you can combine this smoke with the with the flash. I like it. Okay. But but like of course this smoke is fine. But mulling pit is good as well. Like just mulling like. Peeking, obviously, if he's not fighting you, you molly. But it's very common that people play around the one-way smoke. So they smoke right, here, yes. and then play around the one-way smoke. So Definitely. how to deal with that? Let's let's talk how to deal with that. So people do do this. They just right kick a smoke here, and just play like this in the one-way. Yes. But there is a molly that mollies be because normal molly look. I'm from a molly. It's extinguished. Mm -hmm. But if you go here and aim at the same shadow and jump throw. You will molly exactly behind the bike. Oh, wow. Okay. So the guy cannot stand in the one way. That's great. I didn't know about that. Yeah. So if a guy like is here and then he does his one way, you know, and he plays around it, you just go here very quickly molly, then hide, obviously, wait for the molly to spread and you're good to go. That's awesome. Okay. Super cool. And he can stand here, but not in the one way. Hey everyone, so I just wanted to give you all a bit of a progress update and share some thoughts with you about how the coaching is going, as well as just thank you all for watching and enjoying these videos so much. I've been so excited that these videos have resonated with people, and I'm glad that I get to share my journey, uh, working to get better at this game, as well as all the great information from PNX with all of you, so thank you. So the clips playing in the background here are going to be me trying to implement some of the teaching I've, I've learned from these coaching sessions. We've only had a few sessions together, but I really am slowly starting to see the improvement in my gameplay. I've really wanted to work on one or two specific maps at a time, so I've been mostly playing matchmaking, which, you know, it's a crapshoot due to face its parallel ranked system. I get level 7 gold novas in my lobbies and I want to die, but it, it's just comes with the territory unfortunately but i basically have been playing every day uh, i've ranked up a couple times which is cool at the start of this series i was nova 3 uh, a couple days ago i ranked up to master guardian which is pretty cool i have at times been frustrated with how slow the progress has been but i'm definitely having a lot of fun implementing pnx's teachings and i hope you'll continue to follow me on my quest to get good at counter-strike i do stream every once in a while, so I'm going to drop my Twitch link here. Feel free to follow along and come chat with me when I'm live. And yeah, thanks again so much. Really appreciate it. Bye. Oh yeah, wait, just one last thing. In this demo that we went over for this video, I was actually playing with people who recognized me from YouTube, which was pretty crazy. Is that famous YouTuber Xbox Lazada? I mean, PlayStation Pizza? Uh... No comment, no comment, no comment. Oh, I, I gotta go. I gotta go. <laughs> if you're watching, shoutouts. Thanks for being good teammates.